Today called for squat power and deadlifts. My final working set for squats was 405 pounds for a single at RPE 9. Deadlifts were at 360 pounds for three triples. And I gotta say my deadlifts have been feeling a lot more comfortable lately. My confidence has been going up with them. Learning to engage my lats more, keeping my hips closer to the bar. And the bar path is just looking a lot better. Engaging the lats helps to both shorten the lever arm between the hips and the bar and shortens the range of motion of the movement. And also, if you're watching this video, then I'm currently less than four weeks out from my meet. Tonight's dinner, so we're going to take notes. With Feynman and Peter, the two masterminds behind my powerlifting program, helping me set up Very for mastermind. my meet. Very mastermind. A little sneak peek at Peter's programming, some Excel sheet. This guy's really knowledgeable, so if you guys need any help or advice. check out our advice. The actual spreadsheet? Yeah, so for all my athletes, I have a profile for them. This is Niels right here. Confidential info. But uh, his programming. Yep. We're working on his last block before the meet. So we're pretty much all, all of us are a month out. Um, it's very exciting. So tonight we're just discussing over my program, trying to see what needs to be done for my last block of training before the competition. Figuring out things such as uh, how to taper, um, openers, etc. Maybe I'll discuss that with you guys, or maybe I'll keep it a secret. Is this the one and with let the games begin. Alright, so after talking to Peter and Feynman last night, we decided that this week I'm going to take a deload. It's been about like 10-12 weeks since I've deloaded, so it's about time that I let my body recover, let my central nervous system get some time to rest, and let my joints get some relief. We saw this guy in Long Beach, he feeds this French Bulldog just like raw meat, and it was like the- Deloading session is pretty simple today. 275 pounds for two triples and literally no accessory work, nothing else. The idea is just for optimal recovery, but active recovery, I like to call it. These two squat clips are actually filmed with my buddy Sony A5100 and I gotta say the quality is just so crisp. Probably gonna pick one up soon. This is my last night of not tracking macronutrients before my competition and I'm gonna feast on Korean barbecue with Z Bay. Final meal of the night coconut cookies, cookie dough ice cream, and purple rain. <laughs> 